Hello, welcome to Rad System Studio. My name is Tuzik. In today's episode of Ad Page Properties, we're going to learn how to configure input field min length and max length validation. I'm working with a project I created by name Project 2. This project has three tables which includes customers, products and sales. Now let's get started. On your left hand side, locate database table and select any table of your choice from your project. I'm going to use the sales table on your immediate next column, locate and click on add pages. On the add page fields column, we can see the list of fields from the table we selected. I'm going to use total price field for demonstration. On the field properties, locate the validation section. This section has six properties, but we're going to focus on the min length and max length. The name is set to min length and max length because the, the field text box type is set to text. Let's change the text box type to numbers. Observe what happened. The label changes to max value and min value. That's impressive. Taking it one at a time. Let's set the text box type to text for now. But before we continue, let's publish and preview our project in browser of our choice. Navigate to the table of interest and click on add new button. Over here, we have various fields from our table. Let's quickly fill this form. Please observe, our users can set the value in the total price to any length without limit and that can be discouraging sometimes. Let's submit this form, and we can all see what we have here. To fix this, we have to set the field maximum length to a specific number, that's where max length comes in, I'm going to set it to just 5, but you can set it to any number of your choice. Let's publish our project and then preview it in the browser. We are going to fill this form briefly. Observe what happens next. When inputting on the total price field, it's able to pick a limited number of characters, and that's just a maximum of 5. The next property is the min length. This property sets a minimum number of value a field can accept. Let's set the min length of this field to 2. This means that this field need at least 2 letters to be submittable. Let's preview our project on the browser, we're going to fill this form briefly and observe what happens next. When we key in a single value in the total price field, as we can see, the field border color charged to red because the field is set to a min length of 2, and it turns green color when we input up to the min length. Question. What if we don't want to count the field characters, rather we want to sum up their values? So, how do we do that? This can be done by setting the field text box type to numbers. On the validation section, observe the min length and max length property, has changed to min value and max value. I'm going to set the max value to 100 and then the min value to 50. Let's publish our project and then preview in the browser. Observe what happens next. As we can see, any value below 50 is not validated because it is below our min value and any value above 100 is still not validated because it is above our max value. Please note, we can also do the same for all other text box types and the same process goes on for all except the email text box type. Thank you for joining us today, most importantly, if you've not subscribed to our channel, please subscribe for more tutorial videos like this and don't forget to like, comment and share. Hopefully, I'll see you in the next video, thank you.